This is a story of journey to Sikkim. I went there with my friend Shumon and on the way we met three friends. Together we explored many parts of northeastern state of India and experienced a lot of things for the first time in our life. Follow me and I will show you how exciting our journey was in 5 part travel series. Ah, what a lovely day. Good morning everyone. This is the fourth day of our Sikkim journey and I am now at Lachung in North Sikkim. Look how beautiful and peaceful place this is. We all woke up early in the morning so that we could continue our journey at greater heights. After finishing our breakfast, we started our journey towards Yangtham Valley. The roads in this area are not the best because of frequent snowfall, low temperature and high altitude. It is generally hard to maintain roads here. But I was enjoying the amazing landscape all around. As we move closer to Yangtham Valley, the driver informed us that we could not go any further due to heavy snowfall in that area. Roads were blocked and no tourists were allowed to go on that route. After hearing about the road blocked, we were all disheartened and get out of the jeep to look outside to spend some quality times in that area. Just listen and feel the beauty of this place. Then our driver told us that there is a place called Katao which is very close to China border which is quite beautiful as Yangtham Valley. He also told that we could have to spend some extra money for permission which he could manage. Without seeing any other way, we agreed to his proposal and started our journey towards Katao.
As we are moving close to Katao, the whole place has started to get more and more interesting. Big snow-capped mountains all around, tall trees covered with snow, and we are just going through it. This is the feel of Sikkim. I was looking at the snow-covered mountains and thinking how far we are from the chaos of modern city. The landscape of the whole place is truly out of the world. As I was enjoying the beauty of the place, we reached Katao just at 11 am. This is Katao, also known as the Switzerland of India. It is almost 15,000 feet above sea level. All the people are witnessing and playing and having fun with the snow. For a long time, I was planning to see snowfall, snow-covered mountains and walk into the snow. Today, my wish and plan are fulfilled. Finally, I witnessed a beautiful waterfall called Khanda Waterfall. I think Witnessing snowfall, playing in the snow at least once in a lifetime is every traveler's fantasy. Stay tuned for the last part of a memorable seeking journey.